Hi guys, it's Kai here and welcome back to my current household. It's still uh, the same one. This is now like the third time we've done this. I don't know if I've mentioned this before, but normally when I play The Sims, I'll play the same household for like literally ever, unless I, something happens to them or I get tired of them or I don't know. Usually I just keep playing the same household until forever, like just forever. So obviously we're still in the same household. Madeline is heading off to work. It is like Sunday. I forgot um, that she's a landscaper, apparently. Uh, I did that so that they could get more money to get this house. And I just haven't made her quit because I was like, you know what, why not? We're gonna keep her being a landscaper. So there's that. And then also, hold on, let me tell, oh my God, what was that noise? I don't know if you guys could hear that, but that was terrifying. Okay, let me set him up and then I'm gonna show you what I've done to the house. I've actually improved the house quite a bit. Um, and then go put her there, move that. Okay, so I have slowly started to work on this little like living room type area. I did this fun orange color on the wall and then I found these like really long curtains which they don't match up perfectly with these windows but you know what, it's whatever. And then there was this weird painting that we had bought a while back and I was like you know what let's put that up there so I slowly started to work on this room I've got the dining room started I thought I don't know I don't know what it was going for I feel like it's kind of fun and I'm really into these blue chairs I wish I had some like that but I don't know I don't know what I was going for at all with this house it's kind of like a hodgepodge of a mess but I'm totally in love with it like I really like it and at some point I would like to redo like the outside because this is boring like really really boring so, so we're gonna fix that at some point I just don't know when that point will be because obviously you know we don't have too much money oh and we have um, we have another baby almost immediately after having this baby we decided hey let's have another baby so here's Reagan and then we also have Kelsey who's now a toddler I don't remember how old she was in the other uh, household video I should have checked I really should have checked to see what I told you guys and what I haven't because I have the worst memory like ever but anyways, so we got three three girls, which is insane. And then these two obviously belong to Joaquin, and then Madeline belongs to Paolo, which we don't talk to anymore because he's a butthole. He's got children with another woman, so we're not going to talk about that. But yeah, so this is actually my first time playing with toddlers, like, and it's it's rough. It is like real rough, like, oh my god, they are so hard to deal with. I can't even like. Ugh, I can't. Is there anything to eat? Uh, clean out spoiled food. Can we make, can we make something that I guess has to be vegetarian? Because we do have a vegetarian in the house. Madeline's a vegetarian. Again, I don't know if I pointed that out or not, but it makes it a lot more difficult to uh, make food considering, she, like I said, she's a vegetarian. So we have to consciously select our meals. Could you just clean that up, please? Jeez, and then you ignored my demands to make fruit salad. Get to work, boy. What are you doing? Gosh. So they have they have a little bit of money going on right now. I obviously need to finish the kitchen. We are uh, missing a piece of island. And then after I put that piece in, I'm not 100% sure. No, stop. What are you doing? Can you, like, do your normal thing? But, um... After I put that piece of the island in, I'm not really sure what else I want to do with the kitchen. Obviously, it's very, like, plain, but they have all these windows and whatnot, so I don't know. I'm not, I'm not sure yet, so we'll, I'll figure that out. Do we, uh, we could add upper cabinets, I guess. I don't know. I also moved the location of these divider walls because it was bothering me. It wasn't even with, like, the windows and the table and stuff. So it's like, you know what, we're just, we're just going to move them. Why are you going upstairs? What is your, is this broke? No. Oh my god, just take a shower. Why are you going way upstairs? Oh god, these, no, we're not going anywhere. Who's crying? You crying? Sucks to suck. You just have to wait. Stop crying. Can we like talk? Can we talk to you? We can. We can ask you about your day, tell you a funny story. Can you eat? Like, I made you make that for a reason. Like, you're hungry. Why don't you eat? And then you're gonna eat. I don't think either one of them work today. No. Oh, he needs to work on his writing skill. Oh, and she just has to have... Oh, sweet. So she should get, uh, not upgraded, promoted the next time she goes. 
Oh, and she's now big enough, not big enough, but skilled enough that she can walk upstairs on her own, which, like, oh my god, that makes a world of difference. Like, a world of difference. Did you eat? Can you, can you go get food, please? And how long of a shower are you going to take? You're going to use up all the hot water. None's going to be left for anybody else. Can you stop? Go get food. Oh my god. These people suck at listening. Where is she going? See? Okay. She's going to go upstairs and play dolls. And then you can eat. Oh, Madeline's back. Where are you? That is a good outfit. Solid outfit. Let's go jogging. I've been making them all go jogging at least once a day at this point. I'm not really sure why. Like, maybe because I feel like in my own life I should go jogging. But I hate jogging. Like, I will never jog or run. Like, I just... No, that's not going to happen. Mm -mm. Nope, not happening. But I was making um, Tyler work out some more because after having two babies in a row, she put on a little weight, which isn't a problem. But I could picture her, like, being a internet person. People are going to take notice and be rude about it. So maybe she's, like, self-conscious or something like that. I don't know. That's what goes on in my head. She really, to me, she looks totally fine. But I don't know. We just make her go jogging because why not? What else is there to do? Oh, we should probably pot oh, yep, we should potty train her. Stop eating. Quick. Quick. Go potty train her. Oh, and I was having this weird glitch. Um, I don't know if it's going to do it again, but I was having this weird glitch in my game where I cannot bathe my toddlers. Again, this being my only toddler, so I don't know if it's just a glitch in this save file or if it's like a glitch in general, but I could not bathe them. Like, they would put them into the tub and then immediately take them back out for no reason, even though the toddler wasn't like being messy or anything. They would just immediately take them back out, so it's just, I don't know. Are you kidding me? Ugh, fine. Change her diaper and then I guess you can go nap because you were like exhausted. And then Madeline's taking care of Reagan. And she doesn't need to have fun. What do you find fun? I don't know. I don't know much about you. Um, we can invite someone over. We can invite her sort of boyfriend over. Let's invite him over. See how that goes. Is he napping? Go take a nap. Where is you? Oh, getting water. Well, that's good, I guess. Water's good. Can you clean up? And then can you... You... Can you live stream Sims Forever? That seems like a good idea. She just lives in her little onesie, which is absolutely adorable. But she looks really cute in her other outfits as well. Actually, can you, can you go, can you, uh, da, 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 da. wait, can I not change her outfit? Here we go, change her outfit into, well, I can't see them. I'm just going to guess that one. I'm trying to show you guys her because she's absolutely adorable. She's super cute. I can't wait to see what she looks like when she ages up. Like, look at her hair. Hold on. Wait, just wait. Two seconds. Just two seconds. <gasps> look at her. Look how cute she is. Look at her. She's adorable. If I, oh, well, we're going to get a butt shot. But look at this. Look at this. She's so cute. She's adorable. Oh, gosh. She's so cute. And I'm obsessed with this hair for toddlers. Like, absolutely obsessed. And I put it on her because I feel like it kind of matches Madeline. And maybe they all have this, like, brown curly hair. I don't know. She's super cute, and I'm, like, totally into it. Is your man here yet? No? Did he just boycott us? Hmm. What is with that outfit? Oh, my God. What even? What? What is this? Wow. Are you... No. Uh, this, this is something special. That is... That is an outfit, all right. That is an outfit. Wow. Okay, well, fine. Since your man doesn't want to show up, can, oh, whoops. I totally glitched that out. Can we play dolls with Kelsey? Did you just try and potty train her? That's so cute. You're such a good big sister. Oh my God, that's so adorable. At least this is fun to you. Does this do anything for her? Do you get like attention or anything out of it? Uh, no, not really. Um, we're not, no, we're not going to travel at all. Are you awake yet? Why don't you go hang out with your wife? Where is she? Right here. They are married, right? Yeah, I did marry them. Stop. Go, like, talk. Can you reveal deep secret? And, and, let's just woohoo. Why not? And then can we watch a movie together? 
watch movie. Let's watch. Let's watch the Adventures of Space si Spaceship Simulation with her. So we're gonna woohoo and then watch a movie. <laughs> Look, she's. Is she? Are you potty training her? <gasps> That's so cute. She doesn't really have to, but this is adorable. This is so cute. Madeline is such a good big sister. This is this is adorable. I love this. This is too cute. See, I hated. I abs. Well, I still hate. I hate toddlers. I I honestly cannot stand toddlers. But they do add that extra like level of adorableness to The Sims. And then also, like they like they said when they released toddlers, it just you create a bond with them and you're able to make their personalities like think about their personalities more versus going straight from baby to child they get more of a personality whenever they're toddlers because obviously they have personality traits and things like that and you spend more time with them especially because i play on the long lifespan so i spend a lot of time with these sims like a lot because i feel like i wish they had the sims 3 t lifespan um situation things because with the sims 3 you could change it like by day for each level so like teens you could change child you could change toddler you could change baby you could change young adult adult elder all that jazz not really elder sort of but that just i liked doing that because i like having the young adult lifespan as the longest the toddler in like a medium kind of range the child in like a medium teen i usually did long so young adult and teen i did long adult child and toddler was like a medium and then babies was like as short as freaking possible because i can't stand babies and like you could do nothing with them even to this day you still can't do anything with them but whatever so i liked that kind of customizable lifespan but they don't have that anymore so i just automatically put it to long and kind of age them up whenever i feel like it <laughs> so that's how that's going actually how much longer until so she's got 20 days She's got 22 days, and then the baby is just, uh, whenever. I don't remember how old the baby is, so don't really care. Do you need anything? You're just tired. Can you, like, no, don't go to bed yet. Come. Story help? What's that? Okay. Now go back down the steps, even though you just came up them. Oh, my gosh. That's so cute. Look at her go. Adorable. I would never let my toddler play on these stairs not with these holes behind it no way that is not baby safe mm -mm. nope not happening no don't talk to her you two are talking to each other you gonna hang out together tickle merc mercilessly uh kiss her i like never make these two talk so i should probably work on that what is story help like are you just gonna read to her is that what's gonna happen where do we get this book from we just have a random baby book. <gasps> Are we going to read to her in our bedroom? Oh my gosh. <gasps> this is too cute. Look at it. Oh my gosh. I know you have to pee. Please read to her because this is cute. Fine. Don't read to her. Ugh, whatever. Okay. You can go to bed. How did you end up outside? What are you? What? Okay. Can you just like go to bed? Like in your bed? And can you go to bed? I think everyone's good to go to sleep except for you you're gonna stay awake go eat some fruit salad should really work on your cooking skill because like i don't think you have one where are your skills do you have a cooking skill level one that's sad we're gonna start working on your cooking skill girl and then what is her oh wow oh she needs to reach level three of the singing skill oh gosh so yeah she's got the city native and i have been doing a really bad job of uh keeping up with that for her for some reason, I tend to not pay attention to these things until I hit that young adult or adult stage, which sucks because I could totally like finish this aspiration probably pretty quickly and then give her a new one. But whatever. Can you? What are you eating? Oh, fruit salad. The. Hmm. It's a Sunday. Well, no, nope, she's already done her homework. Is there anyone to talk to? I mean, we could chat it up with you, and then she has some other guy that she sort of, oh here we go alexander i made alexander uh over i gave him a makeover i didn't change like his face or traits or anything i just gave him cute clothes because my plan is that her and alexander are going to be like best buddies and then one day they're going to get married 
because I feel like that's adorable. I don't know. For some reason, when I see the two of them together, I'm like, yep, that's the one I want her to be with. That one. That one right there. So that's what we're going to do. And then we're going to put her to sleep. And that's pretty much, that's pretty much my update. I mean, you've seen everything. You know their background stories. It's still the same people. They haven't aged up too much. The only thing that's really changed is the fact that we have an, oh gosh, what's going on up here? What are you people doing? Can you not handle this? Like you've had a child before. No, can you go away? No, stop. You're not gonna take care of the baby. He is. Let him do it. Take turns. Go take care of her. Anyways, so the only thing that's changed is she's a toddler. We have a new, uh, new baby in the house, hopefully she ages up soon. I'm not sure what to do with her. I'm probably going to put her in this room instead of this. This is supposed to be their master bathroom, by the way. Like, I'm going to reconfigure it. But I needed somewhere to put the, the baby for now. Um, I've done, obviously, some decorating. Uh, that's about it. Uh, not a lot has happened, really. The major difference is just the baby and the, the interior decorating. But yeah, anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll leave your comments, suggestions, and feedback down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!